what did you like about uh, this young and experienced group? How they handled the the situation, and what were some of the things that maybe fell short for you? Um, I mean, I have to say, overall, I was I was really pleased with the performance. I think um, we were. First half was slightly different in the sense I thought our, some of our possession was very good. I thought we created a lot of good chances. Individually, there were some really, really big performances. And then obviously going a goal behind, I thought the, the reaction to that was really good. Um, I thought we showed a lot of bravery, um, very attack minded. I just, I, I you know, I, I loved the fact that players were really driving to get forward and run behind the line and attack the back line. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm disappointed, obviously, with the result, but the way they went about the game was, was, was pleasing for me. Scott. Yes, you, Scott. Oh, we have a mic. Didn't know we had one. Yeah. yeah, I didn't think there was another Scott. Um, the, uh, the goal was a beauty. Uh, your thoughts on uh, both the performances of uh, Gressel and Vasquez and what you saw on that play? It's interesting because I thought all night long we got into some really good positions in wide areas and our final ball was not, not great. We had a load of opportunities for crossing the box, especially, lead, in, in especially before that goal. Um, and I think that was the first time we put in a really good cross and it was an outstanding header. And uh, I'm, I'm really, really pleased for Brandon because he's obviously had to be patient. Um, and he's come in, he's had a, a few days training you can tell he's someone that, you know, he wants to be like he's, this is a big moment for him. So that for it, so for him to get that goal and the type of goal it was, was really, really pleasing. Andrea. Since this is the only game you have to assess him, can you give your assessment of Zendejas? Well, well I mean, incredible. I've just, I've just, uh, obviously he has to go back to his club tonight. And um, I was pretty much trying to beg him to stay because <laughs> I thought he was outstanding. I, he, you know, he came in, uh, he's been in a few days and uh, like he's, you saw him tonight, you see his personality on the field. I mean, he's a really, really exciting player. Um, exciting player, good quality, technic technically really, really strong, um, really attack minded and uh, and I just and I just love his his desire just to keep going. I keep going and puts his body in the way and keeps making runs and really nice you know combination play and I mean this kid this kid's a really good player. So um, we're we're pleased that he came in um, and we got a chance to see him and he got a chance to see us. Um, so yeah, but I did try and plead it for him to stay, <laughs> but uh, hopefully we can get him back. Sanjay. Um, thanks for doing this, Anthony. What were your thoughts on Alan Senor's performance tonight and what he brings to the pool? Um, and the midfield balance overall, how did you think that they started and progressed throughout the game? Thanks. Yeah, good. I mean, I, I uh, again, Alan, Alan was really good tonight. Um, I, I really, I really liked, I've liked him all week in training. He's um, technically, he's a really good player. He's comfortable on the ball, comfortable receiving the ball. Uh, in tight areas, he's got good vision. Um, he can pretty much go and pick the ball up anywhere on the field. He's comfortable doing that. Um, you know, th this camp has been um, one of the challenges has been around fitness levels, um, and we we came into the game knowing that certain players could only play a certain amount of minutes, and Alan was one of those. Um, but. Alan and you know and probably one or two more if 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 they were fitter um, and if we could I'd have loved to have kept him on the field longer I mean I thought he did really really well um, so yeah good performance from him. Alan was one of seven starters making their debut tonight the most in a match for the U.S. since 1988. Uh, we'll go back to your right, Anthony. Uh, a little bit more on what you were saying about. Uh, Alejandro in terms of him of course being an exciting player seeing a player like that with his characteristics what can he do for this program well I think if we if we come away from this window um, and Alejandro is someone that can stay with us 
Um, and there's there's obviously a, a lot of other really good guys that have come in and interesting players. Um, but if we, if we get to the, the end of this window and, and Alejandro, you know, we, we've we can keep him with us. I think this has been, irrespective of what goes on, this has been a hugely successful window because this guy's a, um, he's an exciting player um, and he's someone that I feel we can help help the national team. I think he can, I think he adds depth to the team. I, th I think he's right there, uh, you know, in a position where he can step in and help the team, you know, with our full squad. Um, and he's also someone who's slightly different in terms of his characteristics to what we have. Um, so, yeah, I, I, look, I, I think uh, I think it's been great that we've been able to bring him in and uh, we would love to bring him back for sure. Kyle. Right here, Coach. Um, could you kind of assess what you saw from Cade, both in the game tonight and then in, in training, and then kind of talk about how important this year is for his, you know, his overall development? Um, Cade, wow. Like, what a performance from Cade. I, I'm, like, so proud of him, so impressed with his performance. Um, he was another one where, you know, I kept turning around to our sports scientist and um, – coaching staff because obviously we had set times and and as the clock was ticking we had a brick you know I knew he had to come off but I didn't want to bring him off and it was uh he was just he was just outstanding tonight really direct really aggressive brave um I think maybe if it had stayed on he, he you know I think he deserved the goal for sure um but what, what an, this is probably one of the best performances I've seen. I've seen him. I've seen him have some amazing moments. I think tonight show was another level, um, another step forward for him. Um, so it it was a really special performance from him, and I'm and I'm really proud, really proud of what he did tonight. Straight back, Anthony. Thanks for doing this. We're kind of running through the lineup here. Yeah. I'm curious about your thoughts on Gaga Slanina. who had a couple of big saves tonight. What did the staff see from him in training that led to him starting tonight? And, and then what did you think of his performance? Um, again, I thought he had a, I thought he had a solid performance. Um, he's, you know, Gaga is someone that we've had in a, a few times and we're very familiar with him. I think one, one, one of the big positives with him is, is just is like for a young kid, he's, he's like a, an old pro in terms of how he, um, goes about his preparation, his personal life. Um, he's like a top, top professional. Um, very, very mature, um, very confident. And, uh, and he did well. Yeah, he made some good saves tonight. And um, again, a, a, another one I think we're, we're really pleased with.